one day out. Ready for the game or what? Right here, 24 hours. King? They'll be available for purchase later in the year. Let's ride. Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of the vlog. If you're new here, please make sure you do subscribe. That's it, the regular season is over. And we're gonna continue to vlog behind the scenes during the final series, so let's get it. Thanks very much. Oh. Alright, good morning. We're currently in Sydney, so I came down yesterday after the game for the NRL finals launch. So all the captains of the top eight teams are down here and we're heading into the Telstra building this morning for the launch of the finals. I think we do like a big photo in team kit and also some media uh, to officially launch the finals series. So heading there today and then this afternoon, I think I'm back on like the 1.15 or 1.30 flight back up to Townsville. So just down here for the night and then fly back home this afternoon for training tomorrow. So we're heading into the city, let's go. Thank you. All right, so we just got into the Telstra building now. Just gonna get in my kit. Go and do some photos and then media interviews. TV screen, I'll put my boots on. And playing kit. All right, in full kit, let's go. Well, Jens, thank you so much for joining us. It's an absolute thrill to have you all here. Obviously, my question is going to Chad. If you could give one piece of advice to our boys heading into the finals, what would it be? Uh, yeah, probably just uh, make the most of the opportunity. Obviously, you know, you work so hard, you sacrifice, you dedicate a lot of your time uh, in your life to, to get to this moment where we are now. You know, our team, like everyone up here, has got a great opportunity ahead of us over the next few weeks. And um, I think it's just to, you know, give it your all and um, dedicate yourself to your craft and your game and uh, yeah, just make the most of the opportunity that we've got. For all our question askers out there, uh, thank you so much to all the eight captains for being here today. Our official proceedings now concluding. To all you fans for being here today, thank you so much. Who's going to win? <laughs> Thanks again to Telstra for hosting us. Bring on the finals, everyone. Thanks so much. Thank you. All right, what's good? We uh, just got to the airport and about to head home to Townsville, but don't have a direct flight. So I've got to fly to Melbourne first, and then Townsville. day going in to chill out have my dinner have a shower get ready because we're into training tomorrow let's go Close to me, and hopefully you understand G.O.D. Made me this cold and I'm 
talking like no degrees This ain't a fluke, I seen it way before it ever happened He gave me the view, I had to put in my time But the TV ain't coming in soon I couldn't leave it all up to a variant or an experience You gotta get up and do what it do So complicated, the homie is you Always gonna wait until you in the mood I been running Today's the day we're heading to Sydney. Just cooking up some lunch at the moment. And literally just got a knock at the door. Look what's here, some player's stuff. Oh. Big boxes of merch. Lunch, and then get to open that. Have a go at that, turned out epic. Just about to smash this, and then open the boxes. All right, lunch done, time to open. In the first box, we have the ball markers. Let's go. So, have a go at this. Three in one marker. So, ball marker here, bottle opener, and divot repairer. Man, that is so sick. And that comes out. Mark your ball on the green. Nice little close up at that. Have a go at that. Looks so sick. And then it's magnetic so it just goes back in. Awesome. All right, let's open the next box. Okay, man, this is exciting. This is exciting. It's like a, just a sample. But we got a heap of our hats. So you've probably seen me wearing these in a lot of the vlogs. They'll be available for purchase later in the year. They're so sick. Got the 3D embroidery, the vintage rope. They've got players on the inside and players tag on the back. There's plenty of them. Then this is one of our samples for our next hat, but I don't want to give too much away. And these are just a few other samples our suppliers thrown in. So that's it, some exciting stuff. Can't wait to release all this stuff with you guys later in the year. Now it's time to finish off packing. Got to head to the airport. <laughs> What's good? Just getting into Sydney, into our hotel here. And like we always do in the vlog, we always give you guys a quick tour of the room. Staying in the middle of the city. So, a little bit smaller than you, the usual rooms, but nice big bed, chair, desk, TV. And then check out the bathroom, man. A nice big shower, toilet, and so, so <clears throat> just about to have a shower and then go and grab some dinner and then just pretty much take it easy for the rest of the night. Then tomorrow we have captain's run. We're training at Leichhardt Oval. All right, catch you tomorrow. Morning. Today is captain run day and weather outside's not too good. It's raining at the moment. So just better to go down and have some breakfast, coffee, Got my captain's run kit on. We're doing our captain's run at Leichhardt Oval, actually. And then this afternoon, I'm just gonna hang out like we all usually do. That's it, captain's run all finished and done. I'm just about to have some lunch and then we're gonna go for a bit of a walk to Westfield Shopping Centre and kick it back. We've got massage and dinner later this evening. And then tomorrow it's 7.50 p.m. game, so it's quite a long day. So still got, you know, 30 plus hours until we play. Plenty of time to just chill, hang out, not think about the game and get ready. 
Okay, just been chilling out for like the last two hours. Had a bit of a lay down and a bit of a snooze. Now yeah, it's time to get ready, man. I'm excited. This is gonna be sick. It's got my boots sitting on the windowsill, so I'll pack them. Three, some budgies, some skins. There we go, boots. And this is basically what we're taking. There it is. Trackies, two pairs of boots, hoodie, budgies, skins and warm-up shirt, and that polo, roller, and stretch band. All going in the bag. Now, shower up, quick feed, and we're off. We're off to home. The Shire. Haven't been there in a little bit. Looking forward to the reception. I don't know if they're gonna boo me or... We'll see. Spent a lot of good years there, but doesn't worry me. Looking forward to the fun. Let's go! Okay, man. Bags all packed. Hoodie. Let's go. Speak to you after the game. What's up, man? Post game, and it is late. What a game, man. I can't believe it. What a finish, man. That was a wild finish. It is late right now. I just got back to the room. It is just after one. I've just been hanging in the team room, had some dinner. We didn't get back to the hotel till after 12, so, man. Wild, wild finish. Can you believe it, Val? Ice in the veins. What a kick, man. Unbelievable. Can't believe it. I'm speechless. I don't know what to say. But now, uh, the team's heading back real early in the morning tomorrow, and I'm actually staying down in Sydney because Marissa's having a baby this week. We're having our fourth baby this week, the week off. Timing, everything just comes together. So I'm just about to head to bed. Wake up tomorrow and uh, go and see the family and hang out with them for a few days before I give birth, and then I head back up to Townsville a little bit later in the week. So, man, how good. Good morning. It's been a pretty slow morning here today and the boys were out of here pretty early. They left the hotel at 5 a.m. to get on the six o'clock flight. And I've just packed up, tried to sleep in, make sure I've got everything. So all my stuff's packed. I'm just gonna go and grab a coffee and then get an Uber back to, ironically, back to the Shire where we played last night because that's where my family is at the moment. Excuse me, Ross. Yes, sir. I'm gonna grab, grab a coffee. Do you want to listen to my bag? Yeah, yeah. Is that all right? Hold it. Yeah. Back you know where you're going for coffee? Yeah. Just gonna be back in five minutes. Yeah. No, Thank no, you. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, large flat white. Uh, large cappuccino, please. All right, so you might be thinking why I got two coffees, because I just saw a homeless man on the street ask him if he wanted a coffee, and he said he wanted a cappuccino. So I got him one. Thank you. All right, let's go. One coffee for me, one coffee for this homeless guy up here. That's him right down there. Yeah, brother. Thank you, my brother, thank you. Cappuccino, man. Thank you, bro. You have a good one, brother. Okay, did you play the Cowboys? Yeah, played last night. Yeah. Lucky close game. Yeah, it was a good game, eh? <laughs> See you, brother. Have a good one.
Good morning. Today is three days after the game, the win against the Sharks. And physically, I'm definitely getting better day by day. I've actually been in the ocean every day since I've been here, which has been really good. So feeling a lot better after that. I had a massage yesterday too, so I needed to just relax and switch off and that made me feel a lot better. This morning, I am just cooking up the usual. Eggs on toast with avocado. Then I wanna go and catch up for a quick coffee with some mates oh, I went to school with. They actually came to the game on the weekend. This is what they're wearing. All time classic. And then tomorrow, we're actually booked in to have the baby tomorrow. So I have the full tracksuit on today, which I don't think I've ever worn in Townsville. And it's like 14 degrees right now. Okay, what's up fam? Here she is. Oh, hello. About to go in for number four. <laughs> Let's go baby. You ready? Ready, ready, ready. You ready? I'm ready. We're going in to have a baby and it's just all worked out that we've got the week off this week, so. Mm, love you, Valentine. <laughs> yeah, massive shout out to the Iceman for giving us the week off. So it's all worked out perfectly. Got to stay back for a few days in Sydney, have the baby, and then enjoy the week off and get ready for the following week. Back at home, so exciting. We're on our way to the hospital now, so. We don't have the, we don't have the sex too, so. Wish us all the best. Let's go. Woo! Y'all ready? Ready, baby. Ready. Checked in to the hotel. <laughs> to the hotel. Let's ride. Alright, so there you have it. We had another girl to the family. Malibu Townsend is her name and she's happy, healthy, same as mum and bub. Can't believe it. We were vibing a boy the whole time, but came out a girl. So that means we've got three girls and one boy in the family now. And that's us, we're definitely finished there. I am actually now on my way home to go and look after the other children. So I've left Marissa in the hospital. She's got the amazing help of the midwives and nurses for tonight. And I've got to head home, look after the other three. And then tomorrow I'm going to bring the other three in for a high tea to meet their little sister. It's going to be exciting. Okay, we are back and we've got the whole gang in the car now. We've had a few arrangements here to accommodate a new seat, but uh, Myra's in the very back. I don't know if you can actually see her. Yeah. So, uh, there she is. So guys, we're gonna meet your new sister now. All right, you guys you guys ready? And Cairo, me and you, mate, or well, you and I, only two boys in the family, mate. So two boys versus four girls. So we're gonna have to... Yeah. We're gonna have to stick together, mate, aren't we? Ready? All right, so just about to buckle up and then head off and meet the new sister. Daddy! Mummy's in here with the doctors. Oh, We're gonna go that. see her now. Whoa! What do you think? Mommy. What do you guys think, hey? And just like that, we are back off to Townsville. Had to leave the kids and family because we've got to get back to training to prepare for next week. So we've got to go and get something to eat now. Oh, okay, so we are back in Townsville and the weather is really nice actually. Good to be back. We got training this afternoon so I've actually got a few things to do this morning. I'm gonna go do some groceries and Lambus fresh produce and then I've got to go and pick up some players golf club hats. They arrived while I was away so we're gonna pick them up from the FedEx depot right now and then head and train this afternoon. We might open them up when we get home. I know what they are. They're sick too. All right, so we're just getting home from 
parcel collection and also ducked into Lambert's to grab some groceries for the week. Have a go at this. Look at all that fresh produce, man. Lambert's, which I am an ambassador for, proud ambassador. Best fresh fruit grocer in all of Townsville. Obviously as well, got the sticks in there and the golf shoes. All the essentials. I need to bring that inside. Okay, just put all the stuff inside and the hats as well. So, might open these. Now, yeah. I've just turned the NFL on. Love my NFL. These are two good teams too. Chargers and Chiefs. Second and six, handoff. And I'm back doing fantasy this year as well. So I'm just about to chill out. I'm gonna unpack all this stuff. Might open up the hats quickly and then gonna head into training for our open training session this afternoon at Queensland Country Bank Stadium. Should be an absolute cracker. All right, so just thought I would quickly open up the box to show you guys. These hats, you might have seen them on our Instagram page. Holy, it's exciting. Okay, there you have it. The white hats, there's plenty of them. These are gonna be stocked on our website after the season is done. And there it is, going for it. It's our little slogan, no laying up at the club. Players golf club, tag on the inside, tag on the back, and the nice little rope on the front as well. These will go good, I think. <sighs> Just gonna chill and then head into training soon. Oh. All right, time to head into training. I'm gonna take a little bit in, the stuff that I've taken away, and a few of the hats I need to give to some of the boys. Let's go. Open training session this afternoon, Queensland Country Bank Stadium. Should be rocking weather up here, it's beautiful. All right, what's up guys? Well, that's it for our open training session tonight. Finished, uh, it was a pretty intense session. That's it, we'll wrap it up tonight, recovery tonight, and then we'll check in during the week. So today is the day after training last night. We found out who we're playing. We're playing Parramatta at home next week. And I've just jumped into Triple M on the studio and joining the team for the Saturday scrum today. And then I've got a tea time after this actually with Val. So let's get into it. Saturday scrum should be a lot of fun. Looking forward to it. Yeah, look, uh, up here in the north, we love our golf. So, uh, yeah, a few of the boys and I, Valentine Holmes, Scott Drinkwater and myself, were like, why don't we just make a few hats and make it start a little bit of a golf brand around our hobby outside of footy. And, yeah, it sort of started off as what was a little bit of fun and planning to release a few things later on in the year once the season's done. But, uh, yeah, Players Golf Club, it's been, uh, yeah, it's been a lot of fun. 100% goes. Look, for me uh, and all the team, you know, health comes first. You know, you you got you got the rest of your life after you finish playing football and now the protocols and everything that's in place is, you know, really, really great. The HIA, I don't know if you guys have actually done it. It's actually hard to pass if you're not concussed. So let alone you are showing a few symptoms. But yeah, 100%. There are a few tough questions, the curly ones. Okay, so that's all done now, radio. That was a fun two hours. Absolutely love the radio and as you guys know got a big passion for the media talking sport and talking footy especially it's something i'd love to do once i finish up playing so uh, that was a, a lot of fun now i am just about to jump in my car and got a tea time 12 15 so going to play golf with val obviously got the player's hat on but i'm going to do the changeover and i'm going to wear the visor today so let's go time for golf team that is goal done for the day as you can see saw a few friends on the course but uh val and i finished up 33 points and we beat uh tommy and hesse today so now heading home to watch the afl and then the nrl tonight on the couch taking it easy then back into training tomorrow okay good morning it is the day before Game against Parramatta and 
just on the way to train to do our captain's run. It is very warm now in Townsville. Weather's heating up really, really. It's getting to like 30 plus already and it's not even October yet. But today we're off to captain's run to put the icing on the cake and get the preparations all finalized for tomorrow night's game. Should be an absolute ripper. Here he is, the breath man. One day out. Ready for the game, what? Right here, 24 hours. King? Yeah, can't wait. First prelim in Townsville. Let's go. Sell out. Okay, good morning everyone. Today it's game day. Man, it goes quick, doesn't it? And it's back to game day already, man. Weather up here is pumping. It is very hot up here in Townsville at the moment, but uh, got a little bit on today. This morning, just had brekkie and got a few of my best mates who are flying up from Sydney this morning. So I'm just about to go and pick them up from the airport and then Actually, before that, I'm going to duck into the depot to pick up something I missed a delivery yesterday. I think it's for some players merch, so I'll quickly grab that. Go and pick the boys up. We're going to go and have a quick coffee and some brekkie. Uh, they'll have some brekkie in, uh, in the town. And then after that, I might go for a quick swim and probably drop them to the pub because I probably want to go for a beer and I'll just be preparing for the game for the rest of the day, taking it easy. Uh, we don't play till like 7.50, so it's quite a long day. So I usually like to just get out and about and... Um, yeah, make the most of it so the day goes a little bit quicker. Might even have a little bit of a sleep this afternoon. So let's go, go pick these, uh, I think they're shirts, and then um, we'll go and grab the boys as well. Thank you. What's up, babe? Yes. Thanks, mate. We had um, Scott in here. Yeah, good luck. Awesome. Good Thank game. Much. Appreciate it. All right. Have a good one. Okay, yep, uh, the sample polo shirts. Go pick the boys up from the airport now. Oh my god, have a look at these blokes. <laughs> oh, my. oh my god. Have a go at these blokes. <laughs> On a steel mob, sir, man! Hello, boys, how's the flight? Yeah, yeah. Oh, sure. yeah. 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 What's up everyone? <clears throat> Just got to the ground and it's game time. Parramatta tonight, Queensland Country Bank Stadium. It's a sellout crowd, huge game, and we're just about to walk into the sheds and get it all started, so let's go. Just pipped at the post. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a little bit lost for words to be honest. It's um you know, the season that we've had, I'm just so so proud of the boys and I just didn't want it to end and um, it's been you know so enjoyable and you know like I said I'm just I'm just so proud of the guys and um, you know we we just we just couldn't get it done tonight. What's going on guys? It's a few days since our game against Parramatta and I've taken time to reflect on not only the game but also the season and although we came up short there's so much to take out of this season. It has been an incredible journey uh, since my family and I have moved up here to North Queensland to play for the Cowboys. I've loved every single minute of my first season wearing the Cowboys jersey. I want to say a massive thank you to all Cowboys members and fans for your support. Throughout the whole season it's been an incredible journey and I think we've got so much to build on for next season and beyond with this squad that we have at the moment it's exciting love the boys I love being around the town and I'm just really happy um, but also sad at the same time because we obviously didn't get the job done but um, yeah, like I said so many lessons to take out of this season and I really really do look forward to what's ahead next season so now that the season is done, it's time for me to just relax and hang out with the family. I'm really looking forward to spending time with my kids and my wife and just take it easy. We'll rest and recover for the next couple of weeks, just let my body heal from the season. So that means playing a little bit of golf, which I'm excited about. And of course, we are launching Players Golf Club in November. We don't have an exact date yet, but we will keep you guys posted. Make sure you check the website, www.players.com.au 
sign up to the newsletter and you will get first dibs about when we release. I really hope you enjoyed this vlog, the finals vlog. It's probably one of my longest vlogs that I've ever done. I really enjoyed making it for you guys over the last couple of weeks. If you do enjoy these videos, please make sure you do subscribe. This year on YouTube has been an incredible journey. I want to say a massive thanks to you guys who have been supporting the channel, liking, commenting, and sharing the videos, chatting to me in and around the games, after games, that you enjoy watching the video. I really do look forward to bringing you some more YouTube content in the years to come. By the way, just before we duck off, I have created my own website too, chadtownsend.com.au. If you head over to that website and you sign up to that newsletter, I will be giving away some signed Cowboys merch and also some signed boots to a lucky winner who signs up to that website as well. So I've got some exciting stuff coming in the future. Please make sure you do subscribe. Take care. Take it easy. We'll be dropping a few vlogs in the off season. And as always, we'll see you guys on the next episode. <laughs>